The Adelaide Televisual Preservation Society proudly presents a classic clip from the archives. Okay, book of the week time again, Norman. And I believe you brought in a little something special for us once again. Oh, I always bring in things that... Oh, yes, I always bring in uh, extra special literary goodies for the uh, fans at home. And uh, today... What's that? It's a little red book, isn't it? it? it well, it's, it's, a, it's a little orange book. Yes, it's more of a... I think it used to be red, now it's orange, sitting in the sun too long. Uh, this is one of my favourites. It's another oldie. It's called The City of Adelaide Reference Book 1973, 74, uh, 72. Not necessarily in that order. And uh, this is just fascinating. They used to print these every three years. And um, it's great. It's just got lots of uh, fun facts about uh, our fair city. Uh, everything from uh, you know the zoological gardens here. Uh, Royal Adelaide Hospital extension. Almost broke the spine. That's <laughs> uh, a scepter of some kind. Very interesting. And um, oh, here's a fun fact as well. There's a, there's a nice picture of uh, the old Lord Mayor, uh, Mr. William Hubert Hayes. He was actually the maternal grandfather of TV funny man Daryl Summers. Daryl Summers? Yes. Uh, what, what is he? He's the, he's the man on the, the Saturday program, is that right? That's right, the ho-hum at Saturday. Yes. And, uh, I think you can see the uh, family resemblance right there. Mm. Unremarkable. Do you Unmistakable, know... <laughs> I should say. Do you know Daryl? Uh, you, you'd mix in similar circles? Oh, I've, High I've, society? I've, I've met him a number, number of occasions, Yes. Of is he a funny man? Is he still being funny? He's, he's always being funny. He's always on, he never stops. With his little puppets? Oh, it's, it's fantastic. Funny little show? Yes, yeah. I love it. I watch it every week. Whatever day it's on. Pretty sure it's Saturday. <laughs> so, so that's all the Some, Sometimes it's on Wednesday. They do like one of those specials, you know. Yes. It's just confusing. So, so what do you love about the book, Norman? I mean, I'm interested. Uh, I've never seen it before. Uh, well, I'm a big fan of history. Would you like to take a look? Yes, I'll have a look. Let's yeah, yeah, through that. I know you don't have many books in your possession at the moment. No, no, they're still in, uh, still in the storage. Um, mm. Got a city plan here. Can't have uh, a city without a plan, well, unless it's Sydney, of course. <laughs> bloody Sydney. Oh, let's package that up and uh, send it to our friends at uh, Good Afternoon Sydney. I'll get a kick out of that. They're, they're, let's not talk about Sydney. I, I really... You used to host that show, didn't you? No, not that particular show, but uh, I lived in Sydney for a while. I was um, uh, had an important job at one of the major newspapers there. Didn't work out. Came back here. Uh, I mean, I, I didn't, didn't work out. I, I didn't want to be there. I wanted to be here in Adelaide with my people because I'm an Adelaide man. Uh, they just didn't understand over there in Sydney. And you know, fair play to them. They've got a, an okay city, but it just doesn't stand up to the city of Adelaide in my in my view, Norman. I mean, don't you agree? Well, I don't know. Sydney has its charm, but uh, they certainly don't have a book like that. No, and if it did, if they did, it would be huge and too too difficult to get around and you know read it all. It's a nice little proper sized book for the city of Adelaide. Yes, I like it. Yes, not, not it's understated, not yes, too big. Yes, uh, which is uh, Just, I, think that, I think that says it all. You know, it doesn't need fancy uh, leather or hard binding. It's just a sheet of paper. And that's all we need. That's all we need here in Adelaide. We don't need any of the ostentatious uh, rubbish that you see over there on the East Coast. No offence to our Sydney viewers. If they happen to watch the Adelaide program, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. Well, they do get us in the Silver City of Broken Hill. Of, of course. Which, uh, uh, that and, is in and, the same and shout, state. Shout out to our loyal listeners up in Broken Hill. Uh, if anyone's recording this and then mailing it to their friends or family in uh, in Sydney, are they, hello. Are they getting this on a half hour ahead? Do they see it half an hour before it goes out? Uh, yes. So uh, they they saw us uh, sitting here practicing. And uh, so, most of the studio was empty for that time. So they saw that this was, half an hour. <laughs> that was sent through by accident. I apologise for that. No, I'm only joking. Of course not. They, it's a, it's a time delay. Pretty sure they get it half an hour because uh, can't broadcast an hour show on the half hour. It just doesn't work. So uh, they wait half an hour. Is that so? Yeah. Well, good on you. You're a very good sports over there in Broken Hill, and we we do appreciate it. Uh, it's a lovely city. Uh, 
Silver City. Uh, it's got the, the mining. It's got uh, rocks. Oh, I mean, I've never been. Have you been, Norman? Uh, no. 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 Your no. considerable mining interests don't no, take just, you that far. No, I don't. Uh, I don't personally attend to those. I just beam myself in via the uh, miracle of television. Well, cheerio to you all in uh, Broken Hill. So uh, that that's this week's book of the week. Yes, that's pretty much it. Thank you very much. There's nothing like taking a stroll in the early hours of the morning up past Montefiore Hill and gazing into the eyes of Colonel Light as he points his finger down upon the spectacular planned city of Adelaide. Ooh, just a night in with the books. Oh, anthropology, sociology, Physiognomy. Best we don't go into that one. GAA is proudly brought to you by Adolf Johnson Supreme Logos. Logos to last a thousand years. Mm, welcome back. Good afternoon, Adelaide. Uh, we've had a little treat in the uh, in the break. We've had a deliveryman come mm. in. Uh, he's brought a little package, well, a large package, uh, as you can see. There's a large deliveryman as well. Get off that motorbike. He was on the chubby side, you could say. Um, well, what do you think it could be? Were you, were you expecting a delivery? Well, uh, uh, you know, it's not quite Christmas time, but um, who knows? There is a note there. Should. Should we open it live on air? All right, I'll, I'll just open this so up. Make, make, some, make some live TV happen here. Should be fun for the viewers. What's in the, the letter? It's from Martin Place. Do you know him? Hmm, fine fellow. I think we went to school together. Uh, okay. Oh, it's from the, the Good Afternoon Sydney Boys. Oh, the gas men. The gas men. Dear GAA, here's a little piece of Sydney for your inspiration. From all the boys at Good Afternoon Sydney. Oh. Well, shall we uh, shall we open it up and see what we've got? Well, let's give it a shot. Because I mean, we sent them a package a few months ago. I don't know if you remember that, but uh, I guess we're getting one back. What? Oh, what is this? Oh, it's a painting. Look at that. A lovely wood frame. Wow, we. Wow, we look, look Sydney at Harbour. Beautiful. It's hand painted from Killer Billy House. That's very nice of them. That's lovely. Look at that. That's wonderful. The Opera House and half, half of the bridge. The front kind of everything. But, uh, oh, isn't that lovely? Isn't that lovely. Yeah, can, I, can I have a closer look at that? Oh, by all means. Over here. By all means. Oh, wow. What a craftsmanship. What an absolute beauty. Wonderful. Thank, thank you very much. Uh, yes. Good afternoon. Thanks. Good afternoon, good afternoon Sydney. Sydney. That I mean, was... uh, and we, we've had our differences, but um, maybe uh, they're all you, right. You after in particular, all. yes, yes. Uh, wonderful. Where should we put this? Should we put this on the set? Yes, let's hang it up. Uh, okay, somewhere. Yeah. We'll get that up for uh, for after the break. Lovely. We hope you enjoyed that classic clip. Find more Good Afternoon Adelaide on Facebook and YouTube.